September is Suicide Prevention Month, and we have Brandy Vega, founder of PromiseToLive.org, with us to talk about how we can stop the stigma around suicide. Brandy, thank you for being here. Always an honor. We are so happy to have you. Okay, I'm scared to ask this, but I know it's very important. What is the situation with suicide rates today? The numbers can be a little scary, but before we get into them, I think it's really important that people know that there's help, mm -hmm. it's curable, and we have a lot of resources. But statistically speaking, a new survey comes out that shows the suicide rate has gone up 71% mm -hmm. since 2010 for 10 to 17 year olds. 71%. Yeah, it's terrifying, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, can you tell us about your situation with your child, Brandy? Yeah, I almost lost my child to suicide in 20, um, 2019 at mm -hmm. just 12 years old and it was terrifying it was so scary but I didn't tell anyone we kept it inside as a dirty secret because of the stigma and my child told me it wouldn't happen again two years later it happened again and when we got to primary children's they didn't even have a bed available because they'd had so many suicide attempts and it broke my heart and that's kind of led us where we are today I ended up doing a video in my car that video went viral and so many people reached out. I, it was the most vulnerable I'd ever been in my entire life. Mm -hmm. And it was the hardest message I'd ever shared, but I said, I need help. I don't know what to do. Yeah, I remember that video it was so powerful. Brandy, thank you for sharing that. What is Promise to Live? So every 40 seconds, somebody dies by suicide. In that same amount of time, we've created a campaign where whether or not anyone's personally struggling, we want them to go there and say, if I ever find myself in a dark place, I'm gonna reach out to someone, a friend, a family member, a trusted resource like NAMI or AFSP. We're trying to teach people about these resources. Or call or text 988. That's the 911 for mental health. And then once they make that promise, they share it on social media. Mm -hmm. And by sharing on social media, this is the important part because it helps start these important conversations. Sure. The conversations stop the stigma. When you stop the stigma, you save lives. Sure, absolutely. Okay, let's talk about how you collab with other companies and also the big event on the 10th. I am so thankful to be teaming up with USANA Health and Sciences, Gab Wireless. I mean, there's plenty of companies out there, but especially Kevin Guest, CEO of USANA, he struggled personally, and it's interesting to find out who's going through hard times and trials. Mm -hmm. Because of this, he's embraced the promise to live. He's doing it within his global billion dollar organization that reaches people all around the world, because mm -hmm. this is a global crisis that we all need to pay attention to. Absolutely, and the event on the 10th, it's a big one. September 10th is Promise to Live Live. We've got singers, dancers, influencers, celebrities. We have piano guys, Colin Ray, uh, Ty Lopez, Dr. Oz. I mean, we've got an incredible list of talent. Very, very exciting. And they're gonna just be sharing messages of hope. And we're gonna be sharing all those resources. So people can tune in at promisetolive.org. Okay, so we can watch it. You can watch it live, yes, okay. absolutely. And where do we go for more information, Brandy? Promise, the number two, live.org. And the reason it's two is because the first promise is for yourself and the second promise is for everyone else you love. Mm, you're amazing. Thank you for all you're doing and for sharing your story. It is so powerful. Thank you for being here, Brandy. Absolutely. Thank you.